Oh. Good morning, everybody. I figured since I don't ever have time, getting a lot of phone calls and inboxes and people saying that I'm not answering my phone about this function, so I guess I just answer a few questions on my way to this car at this office down here. Yeah, I live around the corner from one of my offices. But anyways, yeah. Um, thank y'all for y'all supporting everything to Dallas and coming on down here for the 24 carat. And some questions that came about, just going to address some. One of them was, can Legends walk this ball? This is the icon pioneer, Larry Ebony. It's his function. I'm just promoting, okay? I'm just helping pop my pops out. But this is an icon pioneer founding father of the House of Ebony. Yes, you can walk. He don't give a fuck if you are... I say, fuck, okay, whatever. It's ballroom. He don't give a damn if you are icon, legend, statement, star, 007, whatever. Get it how you live. That's his words. He ain't down with no shade, bull crap, or nothing like that. As a matter of fact, it's no taking it as a house. And what else he say? Um, this judges panel, my way to try to eliminate shade or anything like that, each judge will have a binder. Every time a category come up, they will turn to the page of that category. That category will be on the page by itself. And it will have a judge's note. The judge's, I mean a promoter's note. Promoter's note will be exactly what we're looking for. So nobody will be like, well, in my opinion, or, well, if you interpret it a certain way or anything like that. It'll be right there in the binder. This is what we're actually looking for. So it will be to eliminate any kind of shade on opinions and how it can be interpreted. Now let's talk about interpretations. <sighs> Realness. Open to all $1,000. That's one of the grand prizes. Thugs, come in your best urban fashion with your best gold pieces and accessories. Gold all in my chain, all in my watch, all in my ring. Don't believe me, just watch all that bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Um, Femme queen, sophisticated lady. I mean, you're going to go meet some old bougie-ass parents. They like for their girl to be, they like for their son to be dating a certain kind of girl. A sophisticated one. If you don't know what a sophisticated lady is, then maybe you're just not that sophisticated bitch. Um, butch queen up in drags. Elegance. Um, you're going to go meet an African prince at this elegant den. I know y'all saying, damn, you walking far. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Shit, I gotta get to my government vehicle. I don't feel like driving to this office right here. It's right here. But anyways, elegance. You know, come done. Done. We always give it to all these banji cunt, banji, banji, banji. It's always about banji. Bitch, can you be pretty? Bitch, can you be elegant and still get through? Butch queen up in drag realness. Um, executive realness. Um, the CEO of a mining company, uh, you know, like an ins you're coming to inspect your company. Now, I'm not going to go too far in this because it kind of is self-explanatory. If you go to a mining company or a construction web, a construction site, you will see the workers and you will see the man in charge. How you doing today, sir? Um, you will see the workers and you will see the man in charge. If you look like one of the miners, okay, I'm looking for the man in charge. You come to do an inspection on your site. Don't forget your goal. What else we got? Um, pretty boy realness. Long as I got my suit and tie, I put up a picture. Don't come here with no Steve Harvey goddamn zoot suits on. No. I need you to look debonair. You see what I'm saying? And you just have to have your gold tie. Okay, look debonair in a suit. Not even a suit. It could be uh, uh, not even a just a all one color suit. As long as it's a blazer and slacks with a nice shoe. Now, it's up to you how you want to do that. Okay? Bring the look. But still bring the realness. Uh, pretty uh, uh, Schoolboy. Schoolboy, do your research on the gold, the California gold rushing. 
have a presentation for the judges to see and you know incorporate gold into your overall effect okay um butch butch realness you know put on some streetwear urban fashion or whatever and just bring your realness and let's see you know can you pass um trans man college professor i need you to come as a college professor with your gold I mean, you know like a gold watch gold chain or whatever you know like a little nice gold ring or whatever but i want you to pass as a college professor um what else i think i got them all i think i got all the realnesses and everything what's up hm1 another day another dollar gotta get it i'm all late i left my jacket in the gov so <laughs> Have a good day. <clears throat> but um, yeah, <clears throat> tag team performance. Tag team performance, Mexican spies. Bitch, if you don't know what a goddamn spy is, I don't know what to tell you. Come in your all black with your gold incorporated into it like a Mexican spy. Think about it. I'm not looking for no damn, really like a robbery. I'm looking for a spy. You know, spies. The ones that go through the goddamn ventilation system and the go through the ceiling to get to where they trying to go you know spy motherfuckers that infiltrate things to try to steal you know fucking high tech shit and everything Mexican spy look up fucking spy shit yeah, it's not that hard. Um, another one I think that was kind of confusing is Butch Queen Face, per the Persian Empire. Well, the Persian Empire had a lot of beautiful men. Now, if you go to Wikipedia and just type in Persian Empire, it should show you all the countries that fall within <clears throat> that area of the Persian Empire. Take any look from any one of them countries and make it your own. You know what I'm saying? If you get anywhere close to the look, you fine. I just want you to bring your car to bring your face. But, you know, let's focus on that look. I am sweating like a motherfucker just from that walk. Uh-uh. Hold on. Woo. That's fine. Yeah, I'm getting old. I can still hang, though. Still look good. And what? Really do. Anyways, um, what else we got? What else we got? It's a lot of stuff going on. Um, tag team, uh, best dress, the Oscars, you know what I'm saying? But that's got a male and female figure together. Everybody battled down to the last team or either the last man standing. But those are some questions that I had got and that I think that I just needed to address. Um, as for the hotel, I know that the rooms are being taken. We're working on an overflow right now. So just hit me up in my inbox. Um, tables, <laughs> they going. Get them while you can. Choose your table that you want to sit at. They're 150 right now. They'll be 175 after the 15. Other than that, um, God bless y'all. I just had to answer a few questions that will keep on coming. Those are the same questions that keep coming in my box. Um, yeah, those are the ones that keep coming in 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 my box. Oh, the call out. The call out is going to go. Well, pops, the icon. Larry, the, the icon pioneer Larry Ebony is doing a call out. He's gonna, if you in the building, he calling your ass out for your category. It's going to be up to eight mystery categories and they are for cash and a $10 pot. If you scurred, just say you scurred. I can, I can call you off the panel if I fucking want to. If you scurred, say you scurred. I mean, you know, it's not on the flyer. So it's not like it's no, oh, it's on front. No, this is just baddest bitch in this category if i see you i call you out and then i call the next one out if you want to call somebody out you call that bitch out and it's just we just gonna make it hot we just making it hot it's for it's for fun and it's for bragging rights so if you are an icon legend statement star a 007 make sure you make your way over to the 24 carat weekend because it's going to be hot this is a place to make your name this is an icon pioneer founding father larry ebony get one of these goddamn trophies I don't give a damn if a legend, if it's a legend, sit them. That's how you make your name. Y'all have a good day.